everybody, this is Kalzek and welcome to Mario Kart Wii. We're to 999 episode 110 and we're starting off here on Cooper Cape. Brand new session from the last episode, in case you didn't realise. And here we are, uh, there's John in the game again and made a new guy in the new session. And he's the main man, we got main in the game. Um, there's so many jokes you can say about main, but here we go. Third place, uh, Cooper Cape's not the best, not the worst, it's okay. Uh, there's a thunder cloud behind us. Go away. The, how did the last ep, last session end? I can't remember. I think it was a disaster. I think it was a disaster. I can't quite remember, but I think it was. Anyway, we're up to first place. Let's make it so it's not a disaster this time. And Main is taking the lead. He's the main man. Well, we've got a green shell floating around us. We'll throw that forward and it just goes flying off the course there. And there's a power block. Just avoid that with a shockwave move. Main is a noob. Oh, look at that. If he missed the, shock, the, the power block dodge and then got hit by a blue shell for his troubles. That is what you get for not dodging the power block. If you had dodged the power block, there wouldn't have been a blue shell. That is the rule of Mario Kart Wii. Don't dodge the power block, get hit by a blue shell. That's a new rule. That should be a rule. If you, <laughs> that should be, that would make the power block pretty good, actually. If you don't dodge it, you get hit by a blue shell. There we go. That, there's one for you, Nintendo. Um, you can have that one for free. We've got win the lead now. We have a banana skin and a green shell. And we've got a bit of a gap as well, which is pretty nice. Uh, which is, uh, got another power block. Make sure you dodge it or we're going to get hit by a blue shell. And it went a little bit wide there, but we landed back in the water. That's fine. And we've got another gap again. We keep getting a gap open up, which is good. Can we get a low trick off here? No, we can't. We're not that good. <laughs> I'm not good at makeup. I'm, I'm good. I'm just not that good. Uh, just come down this here now. I need an eventful race, and that's what we've had so far. We've got a Fungi Kong. Not too far behind. A bit closer than I'd like to see a Fungi Kong. We went a little bit off the water there, which would have slowed me down. But that's okay. Just avoid these lightnings, which are always annoying. But thankfully, I managed to avoid them. And I like the fact that we've got a gap to third place as well. The Funky Kong is closing in a little bit, but we've got a gap back there to jump in third place. So it's not a disaster. If, even if a blue shell was to come, which there will be a blue shell at some point in this race. I'll be very surprised if there's not. Um, so here we go. We've got another banana skin green shell combination. That's normally what you do get in first place. Maybe a fake item block now and again. And a mushroom if it is a certain item block apparently or something like that. I don't know if so many, you had so many items you get a mushroom. I, I, I don't understand the logic, but that is Mario Kart for you. There's a blue on the screen. Uh, went a little bit wide there because so we couldn't go quite get to that ramp. But that's fine. It doesn't really get you that much time unless you get a little low trick off it. So it's all pretty good so far. Uh, another power block. Make sure you dodge it, and I do. No blue shell for me then. Um, that should be the rule. Um, Nintendo, if you're listening, there should be no blue shell now because I avoided the power block. Um, is, is the rule going to play out? We'll see as the race comes to a close. We've got Fungi Kongs. About the same gap. He hasn't really closed up. He hasn't really, hasn't really pulled away. You can't really catch up unless you get hit. Look, the same distance away. And there we go. Uh, the new rule definitely worked out there. Dodge the power block. Don't get hit by a blue shell. If you don't dodge the power block, then you will get hit by a blue shell. If that was the rule, uh, that would be amazing, but it's not. But it is now. It's From this day on, that is the new Mario Kart rule. Let me just wait for the race to finish now and see how many points we got. We should get quite a few there. 79. Not as many as I like. We have a 10 player room, but it's fine. We've got a guest and one guy with 6,000 points. But 9139. Can't complain about that at all. So we'll move on in this episode and hopefully do good. Here we go. And here we go. It is the second race of episode 110 here in my Mario Kart Wii. I wrote to 99. And we're here on Grumble Volcano. Um, so here we go. We had a good race last time. Hopefully we can continue that. We need to get points. That's what we need if we're ever going to get to 9999. Um, obviously. Um, you can't get to 999 without points. So points is what we need. I'll just go across here. For some reason. I don't know why I did that. Oh, and then I got hit by a thundercloud guy. But I give it him back. Take that. Funky Kong. <laughs> that is what you get for being a Funky Kong. Uh, back at the first place. We've got someone cheating. Oh, haven't we? Yes, we have. We've got a cheater in the game. He's so bad. Now he's got a cheat. Look at him. Oh, why? I don't understand. It's a game where you don't get anything for actually winning. But you still got to feel the need to cheat to win. I, I, it does not compute. If I was a robot, I would be saying that it does not compute. So our position is probably wrong. We're probably one position below what we're saying. Unless, it's, no, yeah. If he's done the, the cheat, which I'm, I'm assuming he has. Because he's started driving again. So there we go. Oh, look at that timing for a power block. Oh, luckily that lightning actually helped me because that power block would have take, probably taken me off the edge of the course. But the lightning, in combination with the power block, um, stopped it. Oh, there's uh, John going past me. And of course, with, under the new rule, 
there should now be no blue shell for me because I've died to the power block. So let's hope the new rule is still in effect. Um, but then again, that Rosalina is probably in the lead officially. So then again, I'll, probably, I'll, still, I'll still get attacked with the blue shells because the game is a little bit confused. Um, it normally is when people cheat. That's what happens when you cheat. Um, Snow Angel just comes past us then. So I said we're probably in third place now. I'm assuming uh, they did the cheat correctly. And there we go. Uh, What's going on? The positions, the positions don't know what's going on, and understandably so. To be fair, um, when people break the system, the game doesn't like it, and nor do I. We're going to name and shame whoever that is at the end of this race. First place though, at the moment, is second place. So that's just still be pretty good. Second place, we'll still get points there if we can keep this, and the race might end before we get to the finish line because the leader I think has just finished. If they did this cheat, they might they might have failed. If they failed, we're going to name and shame them even more. Because if you're going to do a cheat and fail, then you are just really bad. And that was look at that, that was pretty amazing. We got a power block, bounce off snow, and landed on the top of the the top route. That, that is pretty impressive. I've never did that in a million years if I tried. But there we go. Let's give us a good advantage. And did they do the cheat? Maybe not. Are they a complete noob? That, oh, blue shell right at the end. What an absolute disaster that was. Down to fourth place. They did fail the cheat because they are a noob. An absolute noob. Getting named and shamed. Live on Mario Kart, we wrote a 999, but I can't believe a blue shell. What happened to the new rule of avoiding power blocks? Uh, we lost 19 points. It was A7 Pegasus, by the way. Look out for them. They are a cheater. A cheater that fails. 8,000 points. Jeez. Anyway, we lost 19. We'll move on. Here we go. And here we go, it is the third race here in episode 110. And we're on Daisy Circuit again, we've had this quite often recently. And it's not the best, and it's not the worst. It's it's okay. <laughs> we had a bit of a disaster last time, Blue Shell on the last corner of course, and we had that failing cheater, uh, Pegasus. Let's, right, let's look out for Pegasus, the cheater that fails. Let's where am I going? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know why we're up there, but oh well, we're still in third place. There's no angel. we just take the lead. And there we go. Alistair was on the inside of the course there. I thought we'd take the lead, but no, oh, we've run into Alistair's banana scheme. And now we're down to fifth place. And there goes the LVK, the Android. And we've got John and Snow. I'm going to go a little bit wide here, pick up an item. That is what I need to do. Uh, Golden Mushroom's pretty good. Uh, should we hold this or should we just use it? We've got a Thundercloud coming up fast. Uh, if that gets close, I'll use it. If not, I'll just hold on to it for a little while. Uh, it is getting pretty close. Yeah, we'll just make sure we don't get anywhere near that Thundercloud. And oh, we've got a power block. I was going to go up the, the shortcut, but. Just in case the public hit me before the shortcut, I went round. And there is a Maniac. Is that the Maniac? Maniac? The Maniac? I oh, know. Is that a random Maniac? I don't know. There is a Maniac in the game. Um, is that Maniac? Well, it is Maniac, but is it the Maniac? Um, I know what I'm. I know what I'm saying. And the Maniac gets hit by Blue Shell. He's gone now, so don't worry about it. Uh, first place. One lap to go. Power block. If we dodge the shark, we. Oh no, we haven't dodged the shark. Then again, the new rule didn't work play off last time, so maybe the rule has changed. Maybe getting hit by a power block now protects you from uh, blue shells. That's why I intentionally didn't get that shockwave move. That's it. That's why. That is the reason for it. First place, and under the the new rule that has just been made up right now, if you don't dodge the power block, oh, and then again, what should I do? Oh, what should I do now? Let's dodge it again. <laughs> dodge the power block. Don't get hit by a blue shell. Um, let's hope that pays off on the last corner. Yeah, there we go. A nice uneventful. No dramas at the end. A nice race. I always seem to do one on Daisy Circuit. I don't really... Oh, there's a blue shell just behind me. Look at that. The new rule did work. Um, it had a little bit of a blip last last race, but this time it did work. But yeah, I always do pretty well on it. 83 points. And that gets us above 9,209 to 0-3. We're getting there, slowly but surely. If we can keep this up, you never know where we'll end up. Here we go. And here we go, it is the fourth race here in episode 110. I'm on Rainbow Road, I haven't seen this in a while. Um, this is a good course, I like Rainbow Road. Um, you can do bad on it though, it's quite easy to do bad. Um, creaky chair there, you might have heard that. Um, anyway, yeah, but here we go, there's Maniac. Not sure if it's the Maniac, but it is a Maniac. Um, and there's Snow Angel just dropped the last down there. We need a good race again, we need to keep moving up the points, obviously. That is the, uh, the whole goal of this series, to try and get to 9999. It's been a lot longer than I originally planned. Um, I didn't realise the extent of my bad luck 
I mean, I knew my ballot was bad, oh, and I knew one, my running into wall skills were pretty good as well, but I didn't realise they were that good. <laughs> Power block, oh, and I ran into another wall. St star out of the way, let's ignore that last bit. I right, welcome, oh, and a lightning, the cows at Conspiracy continues, waiting just into the second, and, and Fruits managed to dodge the shock, but no, wait until cows gets out the, the cannon and then put the shock on, yes. Thanks for that, whoever that was. Uh, third place now. Just jump over here. That was a little bit wide there, but managed to hold on to it and not fall off. Uh, third place is still pretty good position to be in at the moment. We don't need to really worry about blue showers or anyone coming up behind me because we've got a nice little gap. So I'm in a good position. Whoa, banana skip. And Mum Grigio to it floating down the ramp. We're on a little trip. Um, and we're now in third place still. Red shower. Man, that's come a long way, hasn't it? Where'd that come from? There's no one anywhere near me. Jeez, well, that was a one heck of a homing red shower coming in for me but fortunately didn't get to me uh, it's always a bit dangerous trying to jump over these holes oh oh um, oh how did I hold on to that I don't know that was pretty impressive I've got to say I was sure I was going flying off into the abyss there but managed to hold on somehow and now into the star cannon away and we're got a red shell uh, can we get hit fruits with this maybe not it's a bit too far ahead possibly has he got fun off the course there was a bit of lag uh, probably lag because that looks a little bit weird um, yep, fruits is lagging, lagging fruits. Uh, we've got look at the gap to behind. This is pretty good. We're not, we can't really catch up with people ahead of us. There's no where where really to catch up unless they make a mistake. So we can't really catch up. That is one thing about May can't we? Um, it's it's hard to catch up on courses like this. Where there's no grass or anywhere to cut across, no shortcuts, unless they end up getting hit or make a mistake. Third place is pretty much where we're getting. Which is okay. Third place is good. Oh, that fake arm block's a little bit dangerous there. I didn't want to get a trick and just trick into it. And there's green shells all over the course. We don't need to make any mistakes. Let's just go through the motions. Because everyone loves that phrase so much. Start getting away. Uh, uneventful race. Should gain some nice points though. There goes a blue shell for snow. Fruit is lagging again. That might screw snow over for the wimp. Possibly. That would be a little bit unfortunate. That was, yeah, it has. Oh, and I've, I was watching the map and... Luckily, I had that gap now. I'm lucky I had that gap. I was watching to see if Snow got beat, and, and Snow did get beat. He did get beat there. And I just drove straight off the course while watching the map. There we go. I knew I had the gap anyway. Third place on Rainbow Road is always good. Should gain some nice points, getting us closer to our goal um, of 9 under 9. And we're just waiting now for him to finish. But there we go. A nice, simple race on Rainbow Road. And if you can get away on Rainbow Road, you usually do well. People do struggle with it. I do find uh, it is pretty tricky if you don't know what you're doing. I know what I'm doing though, so <laughs> we just wait now. As the race not finished, everyone seems to cross the line. There we go. Come on, game. Keep up, would you? 40 points is pretty good. 9 2, 4 3. Moving up. One race left in this episode. Let's move on. Here we go. And here we go. It is the fifth and the final race, episode 110. Just get the, get the introduction out of the way quick. <laughs> Peach Beach here yeah, from the GameCube. Not the best cause in the world to end on episode 110. After we've had quite a good episode, this is going to be a bit of a disaster. It's all about luck. And there's the failing cheater there, Pegasus. And we've hit a banana skin. And as I said, it's all about luck. And my luck is never usually that fantastic. Um, so here we go. We've got a red shell coming for us. I might as well put this uh, Mega Mushroom on. Uh, I think that is the most efficient way of using it. I do like using that word. There goes one going flying past us there. And there's a power block. We'll just avoid that. There goes Maniac. Who just went into a, a red shell. And now we're in second place. Not the place you really want to be. We're going to go around the outside of the sea because it's going out. Which is a little bit of a disaster. Oh, and then a lightning is making it even more of a disaster. Because now it's slowing the pace down. And everyone can come across the, the, uh, where the sea used to be. And gain on us. Still in second place though. Not really where you want to be coming up to the final lap of Peach Beach. Oh, and I've just been bumped. Oh, and I've had to avoid that power block. Oh, and then John comes flying through with a start. And then a green shell out of absolute nowhere. Bang. Game over, everybody. Game over. we got a bullet bill. With, it's not enough time to come back. It's going to take us all the way around the outside. And there's no, unless we get another bullet bill, there's nothing we can do. That is just the most unfortunate thing that could ever happen in a Mario Kart game ever. 
We might be able to... No, we can't do anything. Eighth place is the best we can do. We couldn't have got any higher than that after that combination of attacks. Oh, dear. What an absolute disaster that was. Not a great way to end this episode. 92 points last. Back down to 9-1. Oh, well. We'll move in the next session. Hopefully, get those points back. Thank you for watching, and goodbye.